Ever wonder what the future of campus free speech will look like? Based on a recent survey of 1,500 American college faculty, it could be more acceptance of violence, more speech restrictions, more investigations for wrong speak, and more deplatforming. A majority of surveyed faculty fear losing their jobs or reputations because something they say is taken out of context or someone misrepresents their views. This includes 72% of conservative faculty, 56% of moderate faculty, and 40% of self-described liberal faculty, the dominant political group on campus. One in three feel they can't say what they think because of how students, colleagues, or the administration would respond. Two in five say they self-censor more now than they did in 2020, and responses from younger faculty are even more concerning. While two-thirds of surveyed faculty over 55 say students shouting down a speaker is never acceptable, only 37% of those 35 and under say the same. Younger professors also report more acceptance of violence to combat speech. While 97% of older faculty say it's never acceptable, only 79% of their younger colleagues agree that even one in five faculty would show any level of acceptance for using violence to combat speech should alarm us all. When divided by age and political leaning, this trend is even worse. Only 64% of young liberal faculty say it's never acceptable for students to use violence to stop a campus speech. That leaves more than one in three young liberal professors who believe otherwise. While this is only one study and more research is needed, these results should give us legitimate cause for concern that the attitudes among college faculty are hostile towards academic freedom and free speech. To learn more about the report and how you can stand up for free expression both on and off campus, visit us at thefire.org.